the Bavaria handicap hurdle is next. There's another two miler, and there's a naught to one twenty handicap. Top one, Millwood Black for Martin Lidl, Jack Lantern for David Robertson. Final termination. Paul Rhodes, gun for hire, David Robertson, six years, James Shea, solid made fiction for Thomas Rogers, Belladonna, Paul O'Neill, walk on party, Thomas Rogers, and Golden Charmer, Paul O'Neill. So, quite a few trainers doubling up in this, but still a small field. And called in, and away they go. And walk on party, and Millwood Black are the first two to show with the orange jacketed Millwood Black going on to lead up the first. The hurdles look pretty small here. And Belladonna has now taking it up from Millwood Black walk on party final termination on the outside it's now being driven up into second they're back six or so are pretty tightly packed as they take the second and they go past the winning post shortly with a circuit to go and they'll swing right handed and take the remaining six hurdles in this eight hurdle event and Belladonna is the leader Leads by about two, maybe three, to final termination in second. Walk on party, that one's inside is third, then Millward Black in the orange jacket is fourth, then on the inside, Gun for Hire is fifth. Golden Child with the green sleeves on the outside is after that one, and then three in a line at the back. The two shades of green for Solid Made Fiction, the green with the red cap of six years, and finally Jack O'Lantern, the second of the David Robertson horses. Racing uphill now then, away from the stand and towards flight three. There they go, downhill. Up and down part of the track there. And Belladonna pulling for its head, wants to go faster. Jockey having trouble to hold it back at the moment. It's already a good four clear. And the chasing pack don't seem overly concerned about how much of a lead it's got at the moment. There's still well over a mile to race. And there's still five fences to uh, five flights to negotiate. That's the first of them. And they're all to the other side with Belladonna falling up on walk on party. Short run to the next, and they're all over that. And the lead is now down to just a couple as Millwood Black and Walk on Party jump particularly well at that one. And Belladonna, though, still the leader, but only by three quarters of a length now to walk on party as they take the fifth. Suddenly, just three more flights to take. And walk on party has come through to take it up so walk on party then is the new leader from belladonna millward black is third then final termination is fourth and solomon fiction is fifth golden charm they take the third from home and over that one solomon fiction was a bit slow walk on party was the best jump of the lot at the front and he's a good length clear millward black now being driven up around the outside though as belladonna drops back to third and might get trapped in a pocket gap after those three back to six years final termination and gun for hire virtually in a line but it's walk on party from belladonna and millward black the race towards the second last flight then they've still got three and a half furlongs to race though and it's walk on party in the lead and now six years comes through the challenge on the outside millward black's hit a bit of a fat spot final termination is trying to run on but it's walk on party by about two or three lengths to six lengths in second over that one they go and it's walk on party in the lead walk on party's got just one more flight and two more furlongs and he's beginning to pull away he's a good five or six clear now final termination in second six years belladonna the two robertson horses are running on but it's walk on party skips over the final flight final termination is surely the only danger racing up the hill towards the winning post now then walk on party's lead is being diminished with every stride but it looks like he's got enough to hold on gun is finishing like an absolute trainer but the post comes just in time for walk on party walk on party wins it gun was second then final termination and six years after that jack lantern finished well as well no work but dropped right out of it and it probably ended up last but all on party needed that post to come, didn't he? And it did, and it came in time. And it's a win. I think that might be another one for nice T. Rogers this time. So there's quite a few people with similar colours there. Uh, walk on party for Thomas Rogers, the winner. Gun for hire for David Robertson, second. Final termination for Paul Rhodes was third. Six years for James Shea was fourth. And Jack O'Lantern for David Robertson was fifth. That's me for day one. And I'll let Stu take you through the rest of the first day.